What's up? What is good, people? See you here. Welcome back to the channel. Um, today, I'm going to take you through my Hyrox preparation workout. It's going to be a very hectic but good one as well. We're going to be strengthening the upper body and as well as the lower body. So it's going to be a very great one. And just always make sure when you go into your training, you are always hydrated. So this is my second intake of uh, Rehydrate. I use a Revive electrolytes. So these electrolytes are are very good and also the nice thing about these is that they don't have any sweeteners or anything that can spike my insulin up unnecessarily you know and just make sure you stay hydrated because if you if you are not hydrated enough it's really difficult and challenging to meet the fitness goals that you want to meet you know let's go so we're gonna use some of the gear and we're gonna need the belt as well so it depends on you with your deadlifts if you need belts or anything like that you can use the belt but i'm gonna use the belt because the deadlifts number is gonna be really really hectic you know and i'm gonna use this as a weight instead of me holding a weight when i'm doing my lunges so so yeah let's go Good morning, my neighbors. Let's go. Okay, so the gym that I'm gonna be using is the one uh, by the estate. So it has all the equipments that I need and yeah, it's good to go. I'm so, I'm, I'm, I'm grateful to have a gym right next to where I stay, you know? So let's go, let's get this started. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, from there, I'll just pull it in reverse, yes. Thank you. Uh, oh, I think, yeah, it's this wheel. Yeah. yeah. Amazing. Thank you. Alright, so the workout today is a reverse pyramid workout. The, on the ski, you don't have to sprint, you can use the, the running as your recovery phase. So yeah, let's go. And also there is no rest in between sets, but if you feel like you really need to breathe and just feel alive again, you can just take a quick break and carry on again. Okay, there's no pressure with this workout. You work at your own pace and also use the weights that are comfortable with you. On the wall balls, I'm using a 20 kg. On the deadlifts, I'm using two 20 kgs plus a bar that weighs 20 kgs as well. And then... Lunges. On the lunges? Yeah. That's what I explained. No, you said deadlifts. Oh, okay, cool. Sorry, on the lunges. <laughs> it's two... Uh, it's two 10 kg plates, so it's a 20 kg all in total. And then, yeah, let's go. Let's go, it's gonna be messy. Without the t-shirt or with the t-shirt? Uh, with the t-shirt. You sure? Yeah, 
Is that the wrong answer? Yeah. Yeah. It's a wrong answer. Okay, cool. Let's go. Oh my god. It's the first one, but the hard rate is already up. Let's go.
We don't give up, we just get better.
Oh yeah. Oh my god. I haven't ate, I'm fasted, and yeah, it's challenging. It's a good challenge because in this way, I'm able to modify my body to be able to use fat as energy instead of firing up uncontrollably when glycogen levels slow down during my race or my competitions on high rocks, you know? You have to prepare all the time. You have to stay prepared. How do you stay prepared? By preparing yourself. Let's go. We are only capable to live up to the image we create for ourselves. If you wanna be a champion, you gotta endure pain like there's no tomorrow. It's okay. But it's gonna end. It's not like you're gonna be in the same pain the whole time. The workout is gonna end. You're gonna go home, chill in your comfortable couch, have your chocolate. What is it again? Choc what? Huh? Choc chocolate. Hot chocolate. Choc chocolate. Wow. <laughs> See what the training is doing to me. Let's go. We don't quit. We don't give up, we just get better. Let's go. Ah.
Let's go. You know, doing something very intense, it's, it's fucking scary, you know, because you're stepping in into the unknown and it's difficult to think straight when you are under a lot of pressure. You can't think straight, but the only thing you can think straight is giving up. <laughs> but we're not doing that here. Take the break if you need to take a break, not too long, and then dial in again. We don't stop in the middle. We take rest in the middle and we finish at the end. Let's go. Uh, you must know that the workout is very, very challenging if the whole time you just want to vomit. Ooh. Uh, and the funny part is there's nothing to vomit because I ate nothing. Uh, and this, the fluid that I'm taking in, I'm sweating it all out. So that's why my body wants to vomit but there's nothing to come out and then if I see nothing is coming out and I see that I'm trying to vomit, that just makes me way stronger because it gives me a confirmation that I just stepped in into the unknown because the body will try to fly in a lot of things. Your mind will try to just like play ping ball with your emotions to make you feel all type of different things but it's all about the intelligence of mastering your emotions that's what it is you no know? that's what physical training trains you to do to be able to master your emotions you know emotional intelligence is one of the best keys in life you know because as humans we are driven by emotions and sometimes you will have an motivation to come and train sometimes you won't have you know it's a matter of knowing what you really want for yourself and then you take the decision after that whether you're gonna go show up for what you want or are you just gonna let it go and letting it go that's one of the ways you lose self-respect because self-respect is gained through you going through everything that is hard and everything that makes you feel like you can't do it but still have the faith and hope that you can do it. You might not do it at the pace that I do it at, but you can do it at your own pace, you know? And over time, the more you get familiar with being in that pain at your pace, you increase the pace now. You're still doing the same thing, but now the pace is different. So Sorry about that guys, the memory on the camera became full, so yeah, as I was saying, you always have to step to the unknown to be better all the time and to gain self-respect and to gain confidence, because confidence, you can, doesn't mean if you gain confidence today, it lasts till tomorrow. Tomorrow is still another day to gain a different type of confidence of another level, you know, let's go, remember, Please show some love, subscribe and hit the alert button and don't forget to like as well and also to share to other people who you think they need to see this kind of workout and the information and seeing my personal side as well, you know, because throughout this um, filming thing, it was always difficult to be, to show my personal side a lot because I grew up in an environment where I had to beg to have friends, you know? And it kind of messed up my psyche a little bit, you know? And made me think less about myself. But I'm still grateful that I, I was able to see what was wrong and fix everything from the root, not from the, just the surface. I had to go all the way back down, all the way to my memories that frighten me and give me so much trauma to try and fix them and bit by bit I'm getting better and 
I'm able to be more comfortable now to show my personal side, you know. So yeah, click the alert button and subscribe to the channel and share this to your friends again, you know. Let's go. It's time to get fruit. <laughs>